Hey Roses, it is Sugar Rose Studios and today I am doing a nice little unboxing video from Target, Target. Um, as well as some things that came from Mercari and something that finally came from AliExpress, which if you guys don't know, AliExpress is a website, um, or an online like website for um, shopping and they have like really low price items with hidden shipping costs as I discovered and the shipping takes like I I think this was like I ordered stuff three months ago but that's like why it's so inexpensive yeah let's get unboxing alrighty let's get started and yes my wonderful tripod is giving us this beautiful view right now I'm so thankful Okay, so I got a bunch of stuff and like, I feel like not too much of it. Like some of it was like really ish, I guess. And some of it was just like, this seems like I should just buy it. So yeah. So first I got these two sticker sheets, which I'm really excited about because I use so many stickers when I'm packaging my orders. So yeah, I think, so I got these in like the birthday party section and I think they're actually supposed to be like for individual, like they're supposed to be individual sticker sheets. So, but I feel like these are just adorable and I will use these in packaging stuff. So there's like um, little animals and like fruit and stuff. Yeah, these are like really cute. I definitely like these, and this is just a pretty piece of paper I'll find something to use for, so yay, bonus! And then I also got this other sheet of stickers, which are like, I think just unicorns and like other stuff, which are obviously my favorite because who does not like unicorns? Probably a lot of people, but... I'm just gonna pretend I didn't say that. Okay, so, oh wow. Um, so these are taped together, I guess, or something. So we get some unicorns and then some, okay. There's like a sticky thing down here. Yeah. And then looks like some donuts and then whatever this is. You just see. Princess Palace, I guess. Oh, so you, I guess you're supposed to give these to like people that are coming to your party or whatever. Yeah, I'm not blind. I can see what kind of stickers I'm getting. Excuse me? All right, so let's take the rest of these guys apart. It's a little annoying how they package them like that. I'm not gonna lie. But I guess if you're giving it to like one person, probably makes more, probably makes more sense. Okay, so I feel like this pack like for sure came with a ton more stickers, but like they're flat and like I like flat stickers, but I also like puffy stickers. So I don't know. I don't know how to feel. I like both, so. And if you have ordered for me or you are planning on order for me, just a heads up, I put stickers on literally everything, like in the card that you get. I have so many stickers on the outside of the package. I have stickers, I mean, obviously like the fragile and whatever stickers, but I have other stickers too, like all stickers. Okay, so I also got some more packaging supplies. So I'm usually mail all of my orders in bubble mailers. So, and they're just really convenient to send things in. So I have these, um, oh, but I didn't get more, I need more four by sevens. But then I also got these for bigger orders because I usually will do like six by six boxes for like multiple like courses because I don't, because they won't really fit in a nine by six. So I got these size, which are eight and a half by 11. So yeah. Okay, so the next thing I have here is 
this um which is the primer that i use and i will be including more about this in my um repaint tutorial video which will be coming out soon but um i usually will use this kind of primer so and then i also got some blank note cards for um adoption cards what so i will print adoption cards onto these awesome note cards um and they are really really helpful and they're just unrolled so got those two and then of course the infamous tape we love tape so this is just um some packaging tape that i will use what the heck that will use that's useful for um packing boxes and orders and things so we need that and then also this double-sided sticky tape is just like useful for literally anything so if you don't ever use this 10 out of 10 recommend okay and the last thing that's like sort of like this i got this caddy for like three dollars and i'm super happy because i can like put some paint brushes here and i could put like some other stuff in here and then something on this side and it's gonna be really useful i think i might actually go back and get like one or two more just because they were so inexpensive and like they're so convenient for like putting in supplies and carrying them okay so that is it for all of the boring shipping stuff and now we're gonna open some really fun stuff that i also got from target that like i just felt like i wanted to buy all right so um my brother is obsessed with legos so i was like wow these are interesting looking so i got some lego mini figures so these are like i guess this is one of the other ones series two and this is series 20 so i guess we'll open the series two one first because there's only one of these so I feel like the suspense of these is really fun. You're like, what did I get? What did I get? Oh my gosh, I actually got the one that I was like, okay, because I kind of was like, maybe I want like Anna or Elsa because I love Frozen. Oh wait, it's right here. Duh. Um, but then I was like, well, Minnie Mouse is like really cute, so I would not be like mad if I love how I'm just leaving her decapitated here, but like I want to see what the other ones are. <laughs> I know there's that. Oh, I love how they gave you instructions like. I think it's pretty self-explanatory, but I guess you can go pretty wrong anyway. Oh my gosh, no, they have Jasmine. They have Jasmine. I'm like such a big fan of um, Aladdin, so I definitely would have found that. And then we have Jeff Jafar, um, and then Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse. I literally don't know the names of these, but I really like the squirrel. I think that's a squirrel, right? Yeah. On, on and Elsa, I would totally be fine with getting either of those, to be honest. Oh my gosh, they have, oh my gosh, I lit this movie, if you have not watched The Night Before Christmas, like that movie is the best. And then they have two people from The Incredibles. I literally love that, that's great. Uh, don't throw him, I love that. Yeah, and then, oh, they have um, from Hercules. That movie, guys, if you haven't watched it, is literally amazing um oh let's, we should probably look at our instruction oh they don't have instructions for us okay our, our our person is too easy i guess all right so let's make our little mini mouse here um am, am i stupid what am i supposed to be doing oh what is this supposed to be oh is this a like a lifesaver i really don't know um oh crap yeah guys i'm doing this wrong where were my directions on this Oh, the skirt is adorable. Look at that. Okay. So, why did they give me two? Oh, did I just get an extra one? Okay. I'm not mad. All right. That works for me. Okay. Yeah, I think they they gave me an extra little little one of these guys. This like flower hat. All right. Well keep that for for another time i guess and then she's holding this thing i don't really know how she's supposed to be holding it i guess like like this we'll just make her like the picture 
Sure. Um, yeah, if someone knows what this little white ring is and would like to enlighten me, please. I think it's supposed to be a life preserver because Mickey here is holding, like, the, the wheel of a thing, but I don't know. I think it also looks really cool with her, like, snowflake there. Yeah, I might have to get more of these, actually. <laughs> Look at me, I'm such a child. I am, like, such a toy person. It's funny. Okay, this is exciting because I will have, like, more than one. I really want to get the scuba diver because there is a turtle. And the pea person seems kind of interesting, as well as the sombrero person. So, I'm, like, very excited. So, let's open. What do we get? What do we get? I'm just, like, always peeping. Okay, I got the flame. Oh, no, I got the knight. Okay, it's okay. Let's just pretend we're not mad. Even though we're, we're mad. We're not happy. I was not. All right, whatever. You know what? It's okay. Oh, it's a woman. All right. That, oh, she's angry on one side. And then, I guess, not as angry on this side. Um, <laughs> Yeah, that's interesting. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, she's supposed to be a- I think she's supposed to be a pirate. Yes. Wait, what? Is she a pirate or is she a knight? No, she's- They gave me two of these red things as well. What is this? They just want to give me lots of head accessories, I guess. Um... Or maybe they give you an extra, so just in case you lose it. That would make sense. Oh, okay. This is okay. It's a pirate. It's not a knight. That, that it makes me happy. And it's a woman, or a girl, or whatever, so I can live with that. I can live with that. Let's see what this is we have here. Why did I put this tape on it? Me. No, I'm ripping the first one. Oh, well, hopefully the other one won't be like that, because they all have the same direction, so it's fine. Oh my gosh, I really hope I get the pinata. Oh my gosh, this kid with the pinata is actually adorable. Okay. Oh, they have a NASA girl <gasps> and a person wearing a llama suit. Oh my goodness. This is amazing. All right, what are we gonna want here? Oh, that's kind of funny. He's like a $10 bill, I think. Or just, oh no, he's a green light. He's supposed to be a green light. Um. Okay. And then there's this girl. Okay, this one I'd be okay with getting. This one I'd be okay with getting. Oh my God, this is like my brother with a drone. <laughs> Okay, so I got the pirate girl. I really want to get the NASA girl. That's like so me. Oh my gosh, I love science. Okay, and then the llama girl, definitely be okay with her. The pea girl, yes, definitely be okay with her. She's supposed to be like healthy, very healthy. Can 10 out of 10 relate. And then this little guy with the pinata. Okay, right. I'm like excited now. We got four more, right? No, we got three more. Okay, well. Now we're just gonna hope that we don't get a duplicate because duplicates, I hate duplicates of these guys because like, what am I supposed to do with this? Um, okay, please don't be a duplicate. Please don't be a duplicate. Oh, it's the Olympic girl. Okay, I'm not too mad. I think she's supposed to be a javelin thrower. Oh, why is she in plastic? Interesting. Oh, I think this is because Okay, when I was little, I used to literally open these in cars, which probably was not the best idea, but you know what? It's okay. Um, and I think if you open this in a car, it's probably, you're probably going to lose the parts. So I think they're smart to do this. Alright. Okay. Oh, it comes with- Okay, so I think they give you more than one just in case you lose it or something. Um, all right, so you put on the little Olympic medal. Okay, that's actually cute. Oh, and she has like a, a sweating face and then she has like a, a smiley face. All right, we're gonna have her on the sweating face because I feel like that's like just this, I like that. Okay, I like how she's a girl because Olympics, women power, you know, we got this. Um, all right, so we can have her holding her javelin. And then I think this is the disc, but I I know there's like a name for it, but like I literally can't remember the name of it. So um, if you guys remember the name, I can't remember. Oh, discus, isn't that, that's what it's called. Like the, the thing I had it tried to do it once. I was really bad at it. When I did track um, in middle school, I, I did um, 
they made us try like all these how is she supposed to hold us They made us try to do, oh, there we go. Wait, her hand is the wrong way though. They made us try to do all these different track sports. They didn't let us do pole vaulting because they didn't have it, but I did high jumping, I did long jumping. Um, I did all sorts of things. Okay, all right, she's all set up now, I think. So her javelin might be a little higher, there we go. All right, so we have two guys so far and I guess I'll keep their little extra accessories together too. Okay, next. Let's get this. And your accessories. Well, take our three little our three little people. Let's open the next one. Um oh. I'll give this one to my brother. <laughs> Love that guy's so. oh. He has a shield. This is a knight, I'm guessing. I'm very disappointed. Or no, wait, this isn't a knight, this is a samurai. Or no, it is a knight. I thought it was a samurai, never mind. Okay, okay, so I'm understanding now. These things come with more than one sets of accessories just in case you lose things a lot. Well, okay, so do these all have, oh no, this guy has one head. I was gonna say, do they all have two heads? Or two faces, rather, not two heads because we're, we're not two-headed people, you know. All right, gotta get his little sword in. And get, okay, there we go. And his little shield. Oh, it's a raven. What is, oh, is this guy, this might, is he from Game of Thrones? What is this supposed to be? I don't know. I'm not sure. He might be from Game of Thrones because I watched something about a raven being on Game of Thrones. So I think he might be, but I could be totally wrong. So, and I don't watch that show. So I would have no idea whatsoever if, I, if it wasn't. Okay, accessory and there. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to go back to Target and like raid their supply. I really hope I got the scuba. <gasps> oh my God, you guys. I dead ass got it. I did not think I would get this. Oh my gosh, my dreams came true. This never happens. There's so much going on here, all right? I don't even know how this is supposed to work. I think I have to read the directions on how to do this. Uh, okay, yeah, I don't wanna like screw it up, so. Okay, so this is like supposed to be a piece of water, I guess? What? Oh, I see, so you put this on here. And then this goes there. And then what are you supposed to do? All right, we gotta suit this girl up. All right, I think it's a girl, but I could be wrong. Oh, it is a girl, yay! Okay, oh, shoot, she's backwards, all right, here we go. I love that there's a sea turtle that makes me so happy, you don't even know. Okay, she's wearing this little helmet, love it. Oh, and it has goggles, cause she's a, oh, she's not a scuba diver, excuse me. She is a snorkeler, I'm really stupid. Okay, now we have to put, okay, I kind of still wish I got the drone and the NASA girl, but you know, we're done. we'll live with it. Okay, so let's get her in position here. And you need to be holding your little, plant and your little turtle oh my gosh it is so precious oh my goodness oh my goodness okay super cute all right we love this oh so she's supposed to be like in the water stick her on here will you stay Oh my gosh, I absolutely love this. Except, wait, how do I make her look like she's, okay. That's better. Uh -huh. I wanna turn her head so she's like looking this way. There we go. Okay, that is just adorable. I am in love. All right, and that was the last Lego person, which kind of, okay, she looks like she's falling over though. Whatever. 
which kind of makes me sad because that was really enjoyable. I love the suspense of that. You're like, what am I gonna get? What am I gonna get? And then you get it and then you're like, oh, yes or oh, no. It's great. Okay. Yeah, there are definitely a lot on this on this that I I would like like all of them. <laughs> Such a child. Okay. Um. So, in going with the theme of the invisible things, um, on with these guys. Sorry, guys, gotta go. I actually have like a unicorn one of these. Oh no, your disc came out of your hand. Okay. Um, so that goes there. Alright, these are these. That minute when you realize that you have not been filming and you just unbox like three things. Okay, so basically, long story short, there are these pony thingy mabobs, which are like it's supposed to be these potion things um and apparently so they came in these little blue bag thingy my bobs well i'm saying that a lot they came in these blue things and i guess they dissolve in water but like who wants a wet toy so i'm not a fan of that so i just kind of cut them open with scissors as a um, normal person would do and i'd like to say i'm pretty disappointed in my luck uh, I ended up getting a turtle and a cat, however, I did get one pony, and as I was just saying to myself, because I wasn't recording, <laughs> this pony kind of looks like the hairstyle reminds me of Rarity, and yes, I know this because I watched My Little Pony, and I watched all the seasons, and I'm not afraid to admit that, and I love My Little Pony, and I have since I was like literally three, like before Schleich, it was My Little Pony, okay? So, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about these. i um, very upset about our two little friends here, but the pony's cute. And, oh, her hair is, like, kind of movie. I think it's just because it's, like, thin plastic, but she's kind of cute. Doesn't really look like a horse, though, but, you know, it's okay. She doesn't really have a face. So, yeah, out of, like, the small array of options that we have here, we got the non-horses, people. But as I was saying to myself as well, I'm kind of glad I didn't get a hippopotamus. Although I think the turtle and the cat are like the two worst ones that I literally said I do not want. And then what happens? I end up getting those because that's just the way things are. Yeah, and I don't know how I, I don't like the idea of like, this is kind of cool. Oh, I could put paint in here. <gasps> Guys, I'm so... I love reusing things. I hate throwing things out. Reduce, reuse, recycle. These are perfect paint containers and I'm going to use them. My paint will not dry out. That is absolutely wonderful. Okay, you know what, my little pony? You did one thing right. Everything else though, you did very wrong including the idea of this dissolvable madge bag. Well, I could talk. Okay. All right, and this is the last like non-schlike related thing that I was like pretty excited about. So this is a thing called, I guess, nano, nano bowls, nano bowls, nano bowls. Yes, nano bowls, not nano for some reason. What it says is, your world, your way, uh, fireside books. Okay, so this is supposed to be like a little bookstore. I didn't even read that. I was like, this one's cute. But I know that they had a like gingerbread house and like a little tiki thing, but yeah. So, oh, so there's like an app and like stuff. I don't really know what it's supposed to be, but I just thought it was cute because it was so tiny and I love tiny things. So, mm. yeah, scissors needed. Okay, so this is actually so cute. Um, wow. Ooh, if I could get it out. Am I supposed to take this out? I think I am, but I don't wanna break it. Why is it so Ah Oh that is really cute. 
Okay, so what am I supposed to do? Oh, so there's like a hidden person under here for some reason. A little, little thing with a feather. These people are not very cute, but I will live with it. I mean, they're kind of just like little pegs, I feel like. I don't know. I don't know. This one is like a little girl with a book on it. I could live with her. She's cute. Okay. I guess you could like put that over if you wanted. Kind of weird though. Oh, you could take it out. <gasps> yes, that is what I'll do. Okay, so I kind of like this. It's like a little igloo. Like, I think that's really cute. Um, so what is this supposed to do? Okay, so what I'm seeing here is we have this little house. There's like a little fire on this side. And then on this side, there's like a little book. And um, I don't know if the door opens or not, but oh, yes, it does. That is very, very tiny. And the door opens. Yeah door opens if you didn't have small hands like i feel like this would be very difficult to do and it looks like if you look there's like a little eye thing so i think if you if you look in there oh that's so cool there's like a, i don't you guys can't see it but when you look in here there's like a little picture of a little um nano thingy my bob um looking at a kid and it looks like can you take like the roof off or anything no okay that's disappointing um oh kind of cool still uh but yeah there's like a little room and then there's like an attic here but i don't know how you would get anything in the attic just because it's kind of hard i guess you could just shove it in there but i think it'd be lost forever to be honest um yeah let's see what the directions have to say i think this might just show us the other ones that they have that you can choose from your world's your way. Wow, they have a lot of these. Jeez. Okay, so. Rainbow Way. Over the Moon Macaroons. Oh, I like that one. Rainbow Tiki. Oh, look at this one. The Gilded Wing. I like that. That's pretty. And then Sweetness Town. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not that big of a fan. Oh, ooh, the Lollipop Stars Dance Studio. Okay, I could do that. Is there more too? Oh, shoot, don't fall over. Oh, no. Oh, so these are like the people that we have. All right, so we have Paige and this other dude with a feather. Pros. Interesting. Scuddy's McTaffy. Wow, that is a uh, quite the name. Uh, oh, we have more here. Winter Wonderland. Oh, so we got Fireside Books. Oh, and they have a ski lodge. That is adorable. I really like that one, actually. All right, well, I want to complete the Winter Wonderland since I guess that's the smallest nano, nano bowl. I guess this relates to like an app or something, but I don't really understand if it doesn't, I don't, I guess it, there must not be like a code or something. At least I don't, I didn't see one anywhere that connects it to the app, which is nice, unless this is a code but I don't think it is, so. This is really adorable, I love this. All right, so let's put our people somewhere. So let's put you, you can be sitting on the book. Oh, wow, these kind of hard to get on. I don't want you to fall off though. Okay, I think that's sturdy enough, maybe. Sit, yeah. And then I'll put this little one in front of the fire. That is really cute. Okay, I'm, I'm like enjoying this. This is very tiny. Okay, I really like that. Alrighty. That was like, I think the last little kid toy that I really just wanted to buy. Um, So now this is all horse related stuff. Although our critters from My Little Pony were all kind of supposed to be horse related. However, only one ended up being that. So just saying, all right, so. Oh, I got two of these? I didn't even realize. These are really cool horses that I found at Target. And I've actually seen, I feel like I've definitely seen, I've seen these before on Instagram. And I guess these are made from, by Animal Planet. And they're actually pretty nice. Like, I think that they're, they're really nice. I'd like to repaint them though. Um, but they're, they're pretty actually. So I'm gonna rip off these tags. Eh, ow! God, I'm killing myself today, guys. 
Okay, so yeah, I actually really like this horse. It's like kind of ready to buck, which probably is not the best thing, but you know. Um, so they have this horse and then they have one other horse, which I will show you in just a second. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna repaint these. I'm actually excited about that. And they were really inexpensive too. Like, just like I know like most adult horses are like $8, but these guys were only $4. And I guess you could argue that like, the paint job on these is not nearly as good as like and also they're not like the matte a kind of like the matte paint like or finish that like has on their horses which i really like um so this was the other one do they not tell you what breed it is i guess not um so his hair is pretty wild but or her hair i think these are genderless horses which is interesting some brands do that just because they don't want their kid, their children to be like freaked out when they see like a penis or a, or like the teats of a horses, I guess, I don't know, for the milk and everything. So yeah, they're um, genderless horses here and definitely going to repaint him because I don't like how shiny he is. But um, other than that, his mane is a little, I feel like weird for his body. Like I feel like it's just like a little disproportionate not like disproportionate it just looks a little strange i don't know i don't know i'm so picky when it comes to my models so i might repaint these might keep them might sell them i don't know so yeah okay so this is the really 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 exciting part so this is an order i got from mercari and i'm so excited because you'll see why i'm so excited in just a second Mm -hmm. Where do I open you? This is like such a tiny box. I don't understand how they fat fit everything in here. How they fat everything in here. Yeah. Okay. Guys, my unboxing skills today are on point. A lot of you were asking, like, in my last video, how did I cut my finger? I literally cut my finger using one of these, like... But I was making tack, that's all I did. It's okay, well, this is interesting. They're wrapped in loose leaf. That's a new one. I've had lots of wrappings, but this is... I've never... Never had this before. Okay, so... First of all, we have... The lovely Appaloosa mare. I actually thought she would be in better condition because um, I recently like painted, uh, not painted, I um, used this stuff on the two that I had. So now I don't have an OG model, which I'm really sad about. So, oh well. I can't they fat fit. Wow, guys. They fat three horses in here. They fit three horses in here. Okay, okay. well, this is a pony, I guess. So. Recently sold one of these guys, and everyone really jumped on that pony, so I'm already painting a, um, it's gonna be a dapple, a gray dapple, um, paint on this model, so keep an eye out for that. She will be for sale. And this, this, my friends, is the most exciting thing ever. A gray riding pony. I'm literally obsessed with these guys. I don't know why. Don't ask me why because I don't know why. But I am obsessed with them. And I have, I think, so I think I have, I repainted three. And then I have the original. Wait, no. Yeah. So I have four. And then I have one that is currently not painted. So I can count, I promise. Five. So this is my sixth gray riding pony and I'm very excited about him. And these guys are never going to be, well, not never, but currently they are staying in my possession. <laughs> I love them so much. And this box is so tiny, like what the heck? All right guys, that is it. I hope you enjoyed um, that craziness. And if you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you enjoyed this strange toy haul, and packaging supply haul <laughs> let me know because i think i might just have to go out and get more minifigures and um those like my little pony things because i'm very upset i didn't get more horses 
so yeah let me know if you guys like this video because i definitely enjoyed it i feel re reborn as a child again and toys make me very happy so because let's be honest as much as i love my education i would much rather be unpacking toys than doing this and reading this and studying this so thank you for giving me an excuse to do something fun please don't forget to check out my etsy store and yeah that's pretty much it thanks again Love you. Bye. Mwah.